Well, here comes a sorry piece of garbage Johnny Purvet paving and signs coming in with a load of uh, heavy equipment going to his property, which is right about down right there at the end of my thumbnail there on Staley Road in East Fort Myers, Florida. But the county code enforcement says they're not breaking any laws by having heavy equipment on their property, which is agricultural. Well, as you can see, this piece of garbage is loaded to the gills with heavy equipment. Look at this. Look at this piece of garbage coming in here. And he lives here on Staley Road. Google Johnny Prevet Paving and Sons. Google it. You'll see where he lives. He lives right in the middle of a freaking residential neighborhood. And this garbage is coming into our neighborhood, threatening our kids, our elderly that goes to their mailbox. And the county code enforcement allows this shit to go on. Why? Because these people pay the Lee County Code Enforcement to leave them alone. That's why. The only thing I can figure, because they've been turned in at least uh, six times by the residents here in this neighborhood, and they're still operating. After five freaking years, they're still operating out of the non-commercial property. What do you got to say for yourself, Jessica Letterman, the head of the Code Enforcement Agency of Fort Myers, Florida? There's the proof that he's headed to his property on Staley Road in East Fort Myers, Florida. That's where he lives. Google Johnny Prevet Paving and Sons.